Hello, happy Marathon Monday. Wow, that sun is bright. Week number 20 out of 24. And this week I'm doing something a little bit different. This week I'm gonna take you through what a typical day looks like for me. So I tried getting some footage of that for you guys. It's not perfect, um, but I'm gonna kind of just focus on one whole day and then I'll wrap it up here at the end. So here's what a kind of a typical school day looks like when I have to get up early to run. Here we go. Good morning. Um, it is currently 3.38 on the watch. You can't see that. Um, it is 3.38. I woke up at 3.25, went to the bathroom. Nature did its thing, which is awesome. Sometimes that doesn't happen this early in the morning, so I'm super excited about that. And I'm getting ready to go on my 12 mile run. Good morning, I'm now in the car on my way to the run. It is 3.50 a.m. So probably about 20 minutes after I woke up, had some water, had one piece of watermelon, and I'm on my way. All right, it's dark out because it is still 6 a.m. in the morning. So yeah, I finished my 12 mile run. It went really well. My window is open, I'm so sorry. Better. Um, finished my 12 mile run. I feel really good, solid 12 miles. Um, I felt pretty strong throughout. And I'm eating my apple and going uh, to go home where I will take a shower and meet you back in the kitchen. Okay, we're back at the house. This is the part where we have to be really quiet because the husband is he's still sleeping getting a weird shadow. Okay, there we go. The husband is still sleeping. We're gonna go upstairs and do a little core. Okay. And we're back. Welcome to my room. We are upstairs. Um, husband is sleeping downstairs, but every day I come in. Um, you can see my chair in the corner. Got some stuff on the floor. Oops. Um, but yeah, I come in here. I have my foam rollers and some weight stuff. I usually do some core workouts somewhere in this area. Um, if I wanna write stuff on the board, I can write stuff on my board. And yeah, I have a little hangout. Um, I'll sit at my desk and do a little uh, journaling. Sometimes I will maybe read a page or two on this book and just sort of get in my own, um, I don't know, my own mindset for the day. Like no matter what, I'm, I'm starting off my day with a little bit of reflection. Um, and that makes me feel really good. So I'm gonna get some core in, and if you wanna check out that video, um, I've already posted the core routine I do, so that's all I'm about to do. I'm not gonna film it. It's just a neighbor and a cat. Okay, bye. Okay, so I've taken a shower, I've gotten changed, I have gotten some of my lunch together. Um, I take a variety of snacks <laughs> that I don't, I don't know, I just like take an entire thing of pepper, like a whole pepper. Sometimes I eat it like an apple. I have an avocado, brown rice, sardines. I have kale at school. And then I have a picky bar and a black bean brownie uh, as little snacks if I get hungry, which I always do. I am currently microwaving my pancake bowl. I put pancake mix in a bowl with water and I microwave it so that I can take it with me instead of eating pancakes like on a plate. Um, it's about done, you can see. Pancake bowl. I know it looks weird, but it's really, really good. And it's a pumpkin flax flavor uh, Kodiak cake. So if you haven't checked out the pumpkin flavor, check it out. Okay, this is the finished product. So I put toppings on it, and then you just eat it like a regular pancake. And there's crunchy peanut butter, Greek yogurt, some cinnamon, and some berries, and that's it. And it takes me like two seconds to make, so yum. How could I forget? I almost forgot about my coffee. So I have a reusable Starbucks cup, and I just bought the most fun straws. They're those like uh, metal reusable ones. So normally I use the Starbucks straw that came with the cup, but I just bought these reusable ones. They're metal, and they have little rubber tips on the top. I don't know, I like, <laughs> Weird, I'm weird. Some of my kids need those for their pens, honestly. And in the fridge, we have our cold brew. Oh, cold brew. And I will put some almond milk in there. I use typical almond breeze, unsweetened vanilla. 
really tasty. And sometimes I put protein powder in there, but not today. So after that, we're gonna get in the car and head to school. And that's my morning. See you later. All right, and I'm on my way home from school. I realized I was really bad about doing anything at school video-wise, but that's because there are children and I'm teaching and um, I can't really. But I'm on my way actually to the grocery store because I'm out of oatmeal. So I will be getting some oatmeal and probably something for dinner for me and my husband. And after that I will go home and I will make dinner. And um, I don't know, we'll see what happens from there. Okay, so I am in Sprouts. I buy my oatmeal in bulk because it's really cheap. It's 99 cents a pound and this stuff is light, so it's like two bucks for this whole bag of oats. And then tonight I decided I wanted some sort of like stir fry with rice and a meat or something. So I'm buying these um, stir fry veggies and then I am buying some chicken strips that I will cut up. So that'll be dinner tonight. And now I'm just wandering because I like wandering and making sure that I don't see anything that I need. And then I will be on my way home. All right, and now I am here making dinner. We have the veggies stir frying up in some oil. And we got the rice uh, cooking over here. And then I had some chicken that I am cooking in my uh, air fryer. Um, frying it up, cooking it that way. I'll probably toss it in once I put the sauce that I'm putting in here. I will toss the chicken in with the sauce. I guess this packet came with a sauce. What is it? Ginger garlic sauce. Uh, it's pretty tasty and it goes right on. I also bought a peanut sauce and I'm debating if I want like a Thai peanut flair with peanuts or if I want to just go with this ginger sesame. I don't know. I'm all over the place, but getting my rice, getting my veggies, getting my chicken. I can't talk, I'm hungry. Okay, we're documenting my real life and this is my real life. Um, I just got oil all over the floor because in this lovely air fryer, there is a piece last time that broke off of here and I forgot, so I was only holding this handle and I was shaking it to mix up the chicken and the whole bottom tray that like catches all the grease fell onto the ground and splattered me. <sighs> yeah, that's my real life. Anyway, we're over here. I've added the chicken now. Mm -mm. So I'm just waiting on the rice, it's cooking still. And I guess while I'm waiting, I will clean up all of the grease. I am on an Overwatch team with my husband's uh, league that he is part of. My husband plays a lot of games. Anyway, um, I have a game tonight, so this is my setup. I have my keyboard, uh, decaf coffee, water, and Maybe an adult beverage. Shh. <laughs> um, anyway, I also <sighs> am tired. I'm about to go play for two hours and then it's uh, to bed and getting up again. So, catch you later. And that's all I really have for you guys. So I hope you liked this sort of a day in the life of Ruth as an amateur runner slash teacher during the day. Um, that's kind of what a typical day feels like for me. And I just wanted to give you a little insight into that. So if you feel so inclined, please like, comment, subscribe, share. And I am going to go get dinner started because I am hungry. Thank you so much for watching as usual. And I will catch you on the next one. Peace out, fam.